Hey guys, welcome to another video review brought to you by buymeaniphone.com. I'm Omar, and the product I'm going to be showing you guys today was a product that was sent to me for review by Monster, and it is the Monster Beats by Dre Tor earphones with Control Talk. So this is a pair of headphones that actually comes with a built-in microphone. So really cool product. I've been looking forward to checking this out for a long time now. So uh, Monster finally sent me a pair to test out and review for you guys. So we're going to switch over to the close-up camera. I'm going to give you guys some close-up details of it and basically talk about my experience uh, with the the tour from Beats by Dre, okay? So let's go ahead and do that now. All right, guys, so here we have, I'm gonna give you guys the unboxing of the Beats by Dre with Control Talk, the Beats by Dre tour with Control Talk. Um, you know, there's tons of people reviewing these headphones and uh, I've heard so many good things about them. I finally reached out to Monster and, and asked Monster for a pair of these. So they sent them out to me. And so I'm gonna give you guys my impressions of what I think about this. So as you can see, that part slips off right there. This piece slips up with a little magnet kind of clasp in there. Pops open, so we have a couple pieces of information in here. This is like a little uh, catalog of some of the other products that Monster uh, also uh, handles. Not, not only the Beats by Dre, but there are many other products that Monster sells. So it goes over there, have a little warranty information. I believe this is what this is right here. So let's put that to the side. Here we have the carrying case. I obviously don't have the earphones wrapped up, but usually the earphones are really nicely weaved into there. Headphones are inside the pouch, so we'll just leave that in there for now. If you pull the centerpiece out, there's also another little uh, information, quick start guide right here, some instructions, some information about performance, safety tips, and this is, uh, if you have a problem with your headphones, customer service team is here for you, so customer service information like that. So that's pretty much it. Really like the box. I'm, I don't know. I'm really big on packaging, guys. I think if you're going to pay over $100 for a pair of earphones, they definitely need to come out with some nice packaging. It's the least, you know. I mean, I don't know. That's just my personal opinion. So these these definitely come with a really nice packaging. Put that down there. We'll just keep that closed up. Push it to the side. So let's uh, let's get into the earphones here. So here we have the carrying case. Obviously, it comes with the carrying case, which is always nice. Um, let's pop this open here. Get it out. So there we have the earphones right there. So we have that. And also, there's a little pocket in here where you can keep the... Uh, the tips. So this actually comes with a lot of different tips here. And so uh, let me pop this open and show you to you. So it either has the rounded tips, which I have right on here now, different sizes of those, or it has those double flange tips. And I believe there's two different sizes of the, or is it triple flange? I believe it's triple flange. So let's see here. It also comes with a clip as well. So if you want to clip this to your shirt, you want to use that, you can use that. If not, you can put it in there. So we do have the triple flange right here. We have two, two different styles of that. And then we have uh, about, man, two, four, six, eight, eight different sizes of the round tips, not including the ones that are already on the, uh, the headphones right now. So we have all that stuff right here. So let's go and put this, put this to the side. Just wanted to show you all those ones that I came with. And let's talk about the earphones, headphones here, the earphones. Now, like, like I mentioned before, and like the title of this, this product is, it's Control Talk. So it includes the microphone with the volume up and down and uh, can, the uh, the button here, so you can has a microphone on the other side. One click skips or stops the song. Two clicks skips ahead. Three clicks skips back. Volume control up and down. So really nice feature to have on there. I really think that's something that you know if you are going to get a pair of uh, headphones for the iPhone, I definitely think you need to have one with the microphone because chances are you'll be listening to your music and you'll get a phone call, and at least you'll be able to continue the conversation and jump right back into your music after you're done. So there's that. So as you can see here, it has like a 90 degree angle plug. Which uh, is really cool uh, if you are using the right case. There are some cases that you may be using with your iPhone where this plug is not going to fit in because it has to be flush, okay? So if you have a case that is, that's raised up a little bit, that plug is not going to go perfectly in there. It's not going to fit. So one thing to keep in mind, if you use certain type of cases like plastic cases or you know snapback cases, for the, for the most part, most of the cases that I use are going to have an open top on the top right here. So the plug is going to fit fine in there, okay? But like I said, there are some cases with a small opening on top that uh, it's not going to work out with. So if you have like a case like this one right here with a small opening, that's not going to fit in there. It's not going to fit in there all the way. You can, it'll get partially in there, but you won't be able to plug it all the way flush to the phone. So one thing to keep in mind, okay? Now, the one thing I really like about these headphones is that I've never seen any other phones though is the flat cable. And it's like this silicone uh, plastic feeling flat cable that's really nice. It doesn't tangle up at all. As you can see, I just pulled it out of the pouch and it's not even tangled up. It's pretty much loose on there. So I think... That really makes these, uh, you know, sets these apart from other headphones that I've used before. 
and it definitely has a, a sportier feel to it. So if you like getting sweaty or that, that type of thing, you know, some other headphones use cloth cables. This isn't cloth. This is like a silicone Teflon type of feeling thing. So you can just wipe these off, clean them off really easily, and there's no problem at all. So let's go ahead and get over here to the actual ear pieces here. So as you can see, they're flat right there, and they basically tuck into your ear. And there's a slight angle on them, if you can kind of see right there. Slightly angled. And so they fit in the ear pretty well, but I did have some issues trying to keep these in my ear. Um, if, you've got, if you guys have seen my other earphone reviews, you know I'm really picky when it comes to the ear tips for earphones. It's, they have to fit perfectly or else they're just going to fall off my ears. Uh, I, had a, I had some trouble keeping these in my ears. I tried playing with the, the triple flange uh, tips, and those work pretty well. But uh, I just think the triple flange, they're so long that if you don't fit it in your ear just perfectly, they may fold a little bit up in your ear and it, it messes up kind of the sound quality. So I kind of gave up on the triple flange. I started using these. So when you get them in your ear, when, you, when they stay in your ear, they sound really good. But, uh, you know, like I said, when I'm working out or moving around or jumping around, they fell off my ear a lot of times. So for me personally, the fit wasn't 100% perfect. So that's just probably the biggest uh, negative I have to say about these earphones, just having to stay them in my ear. Overall, the sound quality is really decent. The bass was really nice. Uh, I mean, you guys, I'm sure you guys can, um, you can imagine being Beats by Dre from Monster, you know, they, they specialize in a lot of audio audio, pro, audio products, and so they're not going to have a pair of junky sounding earphones not going to be selling those. So, um, like I've said in my other reviews before, sound quality is really subjective. It depends on your taste. Um, you know, there's audio files out there that only like a specific sound, uh, sound quality that they expect from their earphones. Uh, I'm not an audio file. So for me, it's either they're junk or they're good. And so these are definitely not junk, they're good earphones. The bass sounds really good. The, the highs and mids are adequate enough. Uh, I use these. I, I'd probably say these are better for music. I, I use them with uh, watching movies and, uh, also as well. And it wasn't quite the same experience watching movies as it was listening to music. The music is where it really shines. Movies, some of the, the sound effects and stuff in the movies didn't quite pop and jump out, out at you as, as uh, maybe they have before when I've tested other earphones. So definitely a pair of headphones that we'd want to use for music, which is, which is what they're made for. So uh, let me show you also, guys, this cable is really long as well. It's probably about four foot, four foot long or so. And it has a nice split right here with a little slider. So if you want to make that a little bit tighter right there, you can go all the way up to where the microphone is right here. It's going to have to stop right there, but I don't think you want to go any higher than that. So really nice design, really good quality earphones. Um, these retail for $189.95, so $190 which is pretty high price. But consider the fact that you are getting a good pair of headphones, sport headphones, with a built-in microphone, you may feel that uh, you may feel that, that the price is, is justified. Uh, I'm not gonna say whether or not here or there, but uh, just putting that out there for you guys to keep in mind. And like I said, the one negative I really had about it is the, uh, the 90 degree plug. I kind of wish this was like a straight plug or maybe even a 45, but 90 is kind of tough, especially well, with me, I'm testing all sorts of different cases with my iPhone. so. Some of the cases worked fine. Some of the cases, it, I couldn't use this headphone with it because of the plug. So that's going to be it for me today, guys. I uh, appreciate you watching my video. If you guys yourself personally own the Beats by Dre Tour Control Talk, why don't you post a comment below and tell us what you think about it. I'd love to hear what you have to say. And uh, that'll be it for me today, guys. This has been another video review brought to you by buymeaniphone.com.